Tired of long-term commitment plans? Then Appalachian Wireless has a new plans for you. No credit checks, no contracts, and most of the features are postpaid. It's forward pay, the simpler way to do wireless on the region's premier cellular provider. And it starts as low as $19.99 a month with unlimited talk and text. We are you. We are Appalachian Wireless. Election primaries are coming up soon, and Pike County Clerk Daryl Pugh wishes to inform everyone of the new voting process being used in the county. Voters can now submit a poll pad and have their votes counted the same as a paper ballot. Election day will be on Tuesday, May 16th. This year we had to get um, poll pads, which uh, the voting machines are still not online, they're not connected to the internet, but the poll pads, um, they sync up and they let each other know who's voted because after we sign you in, it shows a record of you voting. Now, um, you know, they vote on this in Frankfort and everybody doesn't realize, you know, Popville's kind of a unique uh, situation. We got a big county, we actually have some isolated areas where people live, but you don't have internet service or it's spotty, so we've had a little bit of problem with that, but we've worked through it. Early voting has already begun and is now possible at several new voting sites, including every Pike County High School. Those who wish to vote early can do so during the allotted hours between May 11th and May 13th. Last election we had 23 polling places. This time we've went up to 28. Hopefully uh, by the next election we'll be up to 30. Uh, you can go on our websites at, uh, let me make sure I get it correct, pikeclerkinfo.net or Pike Clerk's Office on Facebook and you can see a map of where the closest place for you to vote is. But basically all the high schools in the county are vote centers where anybody that's registered to vote can vote no matter where they live. Some of the fire departments and community centers in the outlying areas, uh, we ask that uh, you vote in your own commissioner's district. That way we don't have to have all the ballots and all the equipment at all the vote, voting polling places. Going on now is early voting. You can vote at the courthouse from uh, 9 to 5, Thursday and Friday, and on Saturday from 10 to 6. You don't have to have an excuse. You don't have to have a reason. If you want to vote early for, for any reason, you can just come and vote at the courthouse Thursday and Friday, 9 to 5, Saturday from 10 to 6. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.